What's going on you guys? It is Wanny back on your screen I'm bringing a brand new video in Greenville, Wisconsin. If you are new here, hit the subscribe button down below to join the Wanny family today. And today we are going to be surprising the family with an amazing camping trip. We're going to be renting an RV from the dealership. I am so excited you guys. So let me go tell my son. I think he's out working in the garage on his vintage vehicle. So let's go see what he's up to out here. Oh my gosh, he's working on Christine. Hello, son. How you doing? How's the car repairs going along? Did you change out those spark plugs yet? Oh my gosh, he's been working overtime on this vehicle. It's literally been taking forever. Hey, can you start it up and give it a rev? I just changed these spark plugs. All right, let's start it up. Oh, it started up pretty good. Let me rev it up a little bit. Oh. Uh, oh, are you kidding me? What in the world? What happened to your car? Oh my gosh, pour the bucket of water on the car. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Are you serious right now? Hurry up and pour the water on the car. Oh my word, oh my gosh. Let me get the garden hose and spray it off. Oh my gosh, we're spraying off the car right now. Oh my gosh, this is unbelievable. The car is literally on fire. Hurry up. Okay, phew. Oh my goodness, are you kidding me, son? You are never working on your car again. We're gonna have this thing towed to Gary's mechanic shop okay the thing almost burnt to the ground anyways son we are going to be going on a family road trip to go camping we're going to be renting an rv it is going to be so much fun so grab your luggage from upstairs and we are going to be getting on the road uh we'll also be going to leo's diner before we head to the dealership so let's get going no we are not bringing this car because we do not want it to burn to the ground so let's grab some road trip snacks here I gotta grab my camping supplies from upstairs and we'll begin on the road here in just a moment, you guys. I am so excited. It's a little bit foggy out, but hopefully it is going to be an amazing, amazing vacation. Come on, son. We gotta go. We gotta go. All right, we're gonna load up the trunk right now, you guys, and it is going to be an amazing, amazing day. So we're getting the Mercedes GLE. This thing is an absolute beautiful car. We are getting on the road right now. It is a little bit foggy out here, son. Make sure to check the weather and make sure it is nice and clear because we are going to be going all the way to the dealership and making sure that we can get the RV. I am just so excited. So let's go. Any idea what you want to get from Leo's Diner, son? I think I'm going to get the pancake meal and maybe some sausage links. Sounds pretty good to me. Maybe they have the buy one, get one free special like they usually have going so we could save some money. All right, we are going to be pulling up to the Leo's Diner in just a second. This is literally one of the best restaurants here in Greenville, Wisconsin. It is literally so good. I want the $10 pancake meal with a four pancakes, bacon, and a drink. Oh my gosh, that actually sounds pretty good to me. I might actually have to get the same thing. All right, let's head inside. All right, here, let's take a look at the menu. Good morning, sir. Um, we need two... Pancake meals with bacon and also two cups of orange juice. My son downloaded the app and we get 10% off as well. So we would like the two pancake meals, bacon and two cups of orange juice. Uh, son, it's expired, he says. He said it's expired. Um, Sir, um, it is not expired. It's still good till 11.59 p.m. today. Son, calm down. Son, be out, be outside of the register right now. What is he doing? Oh my gosh, son, get out of here right now. What are you doing? Oh my goodness. I am so sorry, sir. My son loves to play jokes, okay? All right, well, he got it to work. All right, here's our payment, sir. And let's go find a table, son. I am starving this morning. I mean, it seriously is a little bit crazy weather outside. A little unusual. It's extremely foggy out. I cannot believe that. All right. Thank you, sir. I know the man was trying to scam us. You know, we did have a good coupon. Oh, our food is already here. Thank you so much, sir. This smells amazing. Oh my gosh, they must uh, have this already made. It's pretty good, actually. Thank you, sir. We appreciate it very much. Have a great day. All right, this food is amazing. Oh my goodness, I can't stop eating all this stuff. Wow, that was very good. All right, son, bring the leftovers in the uh, doggy bag because we are going to get on the road right now. Make sure you do not eat in my car because we do not want syrup anywhere in the vehicle. Yes, son? Is there a problem? Oh my goodness. What do you possibly need? Should we order some drinks for the trip? Nah, that's okay. We could probably get some from the dealership, okay? All right. Well, we are going to be getting on the road right now and we are going to head to the dealership to pick up 
the RV. I am so excited, you guys. This is going to be absolutely insane. We are roaring on the road right now. I am so excited, son. Can you believe we're going to be renting an RV? Seriously, I am so happy. You know, apparently it is top of the line, beautiful condition, and it is like we're going to be driving in luxury. No, we are not going to be driving the Mercedes. We're going to be like real campers with a giant RV and a bunch of food, and we're just going to make the best out of it, son, okay? So you're going to leave all your technology behind in the Mercedes, and you are going to be like a good camper, okay? We're going to do a lot of fun activities. We'll make campfires. We'll have s'mores. I mean, it's so excited. Make sure you have the dealership lock up the Mercedes until we get back. Yeah, that is a good idea. We do not want anything stolen, but I think we are going to have to actually drive the Mercedes all the way down to pick up the RV because I don't know if they have it at this location. Hopefully they do, but we'll have to talk to the manager when we get there, okay, son? All right, we are pulling up to the dealership. It is a little bit spooky out here, and it is literally, like, foggy everywhere. Hopefully it is cleared up by the time we get our RV, because I do not want to be driving in these crazy, crazy weather conditions. Oh, we might have to get it on Highway 138. Yeah, I think that's uh, where it is. Oh my goodness, it is the most crowded and small highway ever. All right, well, we're going to pull up into the body shop area right over here because we do not feel like walking through the entire deer dealership. All right, let's see here. I think the uh, manager is right over here. We're going to talk with him. Hi, sir. How you doing today? We are here for the RV rental. Do you have it at this location or do we need to head to another location to pick it up? Uh, your RV is at the old Highway 138 dealership. Okay, thank you so much, sir, for letting us know. Have a great day. All right, well, we'll have to set our GPS. It is just down the road, so that is actually not too bad. We'll just have to get our GPS on our phone, and it is about 20 minutes away from here, so it's not too bad at all, son. Don't be complaining that much. It is not that far of a drive, okay? All right, we got the GPS set. It says that we need to take a right turn in half a mile. So we're going to be taking a right turn as we exit the dealership. It's taking us on the back roads, and I am just so excited, son. I seriously cannot believe we're going on our annual family camping trip. I mean, this is literally one of my favorite things to go on. All right, so we're going to continue down this road for about 20 more minutes, and we will be arriving to pick up our RV here very soon. So we will see you guys when we get there. All right, we have our RV here. Oh my gosh, it looks a little bit outdated, but I guess that's okay. They said it's top of the line. What in the world? I think this thing needs some new suspension. It's really hot in here, so let's um, adjust the air conditioner. I think there's a remote over here that we can adjust the air conditioner. The lights are like flickering. I mean, this thing is insane. So we are going to be getting on the road right now, you guys. Oh my gosh, this thing is so weird. All right, well, son, we are getting on the road right now. This is our first time driving this giant RV. It is a little bit crazy. There's literally, like, old lamps on the wall. This is so cool. Oh, my gosh. All right, well, let's go. We are getting on the road right now. Son, you want to run and grab some snacks from the gas station here? I think they have a pretty cool gas station. All right, well, I don't even know where to park the RV. This thing is literally gigantic. I guess we'll park it in a gas pump spot because... We don't want a ticket from the police. All right, we'll park right here, and we're gonna head out and go check out the gas station here. I mean, look at this thing. They promised us a new RV, and this is the clunker they gave us. What in the world? This thing's like probably from 1985. What in the world? All right, well, let's go check out the gas station. I cannot believe the RV that we actually are rented. Seriously unbelievable. All right, we're headed inside right now. Oh my gosh, there's some pretty nice cars over here. All right, let's see here. Ooh, they got some donuts. Guys, look at all this food. This is really, really nice. All right, we got some machines over here. We're gonna grab some soda. All right, son, you can grab whatever you want. I mean, they got some pretty good things over here. We're gonna get some candy. Oh my gosh, they got bags of chips. They got everything here. Wow, this is really nice. Seriously. All right, we are going to get out of here. And son, let's get on the road. We're gonna donate some money to receive a poppy here for the military people. All right, let's get going, son. I am so excited. You sure you want to? You want some ice cream or a donut here? That looks pretty good, if you ask me. All right, we're gonna get some ice cream and we got some chips and we got some road trip snacks. Come on, son. We gotta get going before it gets dark out here, okay? 
All right, well, I'm gonna get in the RV. We're gonna start it up and make sure everything is all set and ready to go. But guys, this is actually so cool. I cannot believe we are actually gonna be driving an RV. This thing is very outdated, but it is still very functional and neat. I mean, it is pretty cool overall. So we're gonna start the engine right now and we are going to be getting on the road. All right, son, you ready? engine's revving a little bit. Um, not sure what's going on with the engine here. All right, let's try starting it up again. The engine's not sounding too good here, son. All right, let's see here. All right, there we go. Finally. All right, son. It's got dark out here very quickly. I am a little bit scared to drive in the dark. Hopefully, we do not see any animals on the road or anything like that. But we're going right now. This thing goes so fast. Oh, my gosh. Whoa, this thing is very quick. So we are going down the road right now, you guys, and we are going to be headed to the campsite. Son, how excited are you? I mean, it actually looks a little bit spooky in this town. I just cannot believe it. I don't even know if the headlights are working. Let's see, we're trying to turn on the headlights, but nothing works in this thing. Oh my gosh, look at how dark it is in these streets. I literally can hardly see in front of us. So hopefully we can get there safely. I mean, it is actually a really scary out. I mean, there might be some crazy animals running around in the streets, so we gotta be careful. We're taking our time here, making sure that it is nice and safe for us to drive up here. Okay, it looks like there's some sort of building up here, and we should be arriving at the campsite in just a few minutes, you guys. All right, looks like there's a house over here. It's the only thing that's not very dark out. They had some exterior lights up. Son, did you see that? Oh my word! There's like lightning strikes! What in the world? Did you guys see that? Alright, well, here's our camping site, son. Um, this is our campground. It looks like it's a uh, church that's literally being built. Oh my gosh. Oh my word, are you serious? Are you serious right now? The RV is like smoking. Our RV is literally stuck here, son. We need you to get out and start helping push here. Oh my gosh, the RV is like stuck here. I'll try to push. I'm trying to push here. There we go. There we go. <laughs> there we go, son. Woo, we got it. We got it. All right. Thank goodness. All right, son. Well, let's set up the campsite here. We're going to put out our folding table. You want to make some dinner here real quick? We got to get the grill set up here. And we got the cooler with our Roblox drinks. I mean, how much better can it get than this? All right, let's see. We're going to check out the refrigerator here. All right, looks super, super cool. We got everything we need here. I mean, this is literally so nice, son. What do you think? We're literally camping in a church parking lot, but that is okay. What in the world? The lightning is striking. Oh my gosh. This is really, son, this is not good. I don't know what we should do. I don't know. Let's finish our meal here really quick. We're having some steak over here. Son, I hope you brought the paper plates. All right, we got some plates here. We're going to enjoy here. I don't know. We should probably finish cooking out here, okay? All right, well, I guess we're going to finish cooking inside. All right, son. Well, I mean, this is actually so scary. Close the curtains. I mean, there's probably creepy people watch us. Look at the lightning! Oh, my gosh. There is major storms on the way here, son. This is not good at all. Oh, my gosh. The lights are even flickering in the RV. What in the world? I am so scared right now. This is actually crazy. I cannot believe this is happening, son. Search the weather on the internet because, I don't know, we might have to flee the town if the weather is going to be continuing to be this crazy. Look at it outside, guys. There's lightning strikes. Oh, my gosh. I'm actually scared. We closed all the windows in the RV. What's it say, son? What's it say? Uh-oh. He's literally saying, oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness, son. What's the news? Hurry up. Heavy storms. Are you kidding me? 100 mile per hour wind? Oh, my gosh. Well, son, we're going to have to get back on the road here. We're gonna have to get back on the road here, okay? All right, have a seat, have a seat. All right, we're getting on the road right now. Here we go, son. We're getting back on the road right now. Have a seat. All right, we gotta do a U-turn over here. Son, can you close the pergola? Close the pergola on the side of the RV, please, because it is not gonna be good for driving with that. Make sure you put the grill away as well. We do not want anything spilled all over the place, okay? Yeah, we literally almost left the grill and the pergola up while we were driving. Could you imagine that in the storm? That would have been crazy. All right, have a seat, son. We are going to continue, and we are going to be getting on the road right now. Hopefully, we can get out of this parking lot. I don't know, son. It is just too scary outside. Our headlights don't even work on this RV, 
The lightning strikes are getting worse as we continue. All right, I guess we're going to take a right turn out of here right now. Uh-oh. Looks like the road is literally closed down here. Are you serious? All right, we're going to have to do a U-turn here. Oh my gosh, son. Where in the world did we go on vacation? It is just creepy here. I am so scared. All right, we're trying to get out of here. The lightning is striking horribly. Son, this is not good. I mean, this is probably the worst vacation that we have ever had in our entire life. I mean, I've never experienced something like this ever. The brakes on this thing are squealing. The lightning is striking. Son, we might have to we might have to stay at this house over here. Let's go. We're gonna have to knock at the door. Hopefully, uh, we can go inside. What do you think, son? Son, why don't you go knock at the door and see if we could go inside this house? Ask the homeowners. I mean, I'm actually pretty scared. There's major storms on the way. You know, they said to take shelter immediately. I don't know. What do we think? All right, hopefully the homeowner says we can stay over for a little bit. All right, well, we're going to stay here for a few minutes. Oh my gosh, this is cool. Look at this. Wow, this is actually really cool, son. Why does it feel like this house is tipping over? Do you see that, son? Or am I crazy? It seems like the house is, like, tipping over. Everything seems crooked. Or am I crazy? I don't know. But they have a bunch of junk here in the kitchen. There's an upstairs, too? This is cool, you guys. Look at this. Wow, this is actually really nice. Look at this gaming setup. All right, well, we're staying at this random house here. I mean, there is a major storm coming to the town, so we got to make sure that um, we can stay here for a couple hours, at least until the storm passes by. Son, I cannot believe, you know, you were able to get us to stay here at this house. But, um... Our RV is literally parked in the middle of the road. Hopefully there's no other people coming down the street because our RV is probably blocking the entire road. I mean, we're going to have to see. Is there a TV in this house? I don't know if there's a TV. Guys, is there a TV here? I don't know. I don't know if there's any TV here. But we need to turn on the TV and we need to see if the weather is going to be clearing up here soon so we can continue on our road trip. Son, where'd you go? Oh my gosh, I don't even know where he is in this house. Okay, son, do you have your phone or something that you can check if the weather is clearing up? Because I am not fine. Oh, there's a TV, there's a TV. All right, let's see here. Hmm. All right, it looks like the storms are to be calming down in a couple minutes, which is good. They said it was going to be hours, but I guess it's a couple minutes, so that is just fine. All right, son, we're going to get back in the RV, and we are going to get back on the road right now. We're going to do a little bit more exploring down the road. Um, checking to make sure everything is okay. All right, ready, son? Here we go. We're getting on the road right now. They said that the weather should be clearing up. This thing goes pretty quick for its age, which is surprising, but I cannot believe our RV literally got stuck on the side of the road. Thank goodness we were able to push the thing out of it. You know, this thing was built out of aluminum, so it's pretty light. So we are riding on the road right now, and we are going to be doing a little bit more exploring as we continue through the neighborhood here. I mean, this town is a little bit creepy, to be honest, so I think maybe it would be the best decision to just head back home. What do you think, son? I think we're just going to have to head back home and, you know, go exploring a little bit more when we get back home. So we are going to be heading home right now. I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you guys did, make sure you guys drop a like, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe to join the Wanny family today. Thanks for watching, everybody, and we will see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.